and the worst is yet to come. By recovering all the power it has lost, it could break the seal from the other side. I get it now. So that's how good he is playing to use radio. Yeah. If we don't stop him, the world will end. The problem is his destination. Izzy, remember what you saw on the other side of the gate the kitty had opened? It had to have been Calamity's Edge. Calamity's Edge? A space situated in between this world and the other plane. Right. That's how we locked away the Fathomless Dread. The Earthmates opened a gate to Calamity's Edge. I don't know how to... I don't know how to do anything like that. Yeah. Well, no matter. Even if you did know a way, I doubt you could pull it off by yourself. Gideon could only open a gate thanks to the Fathomless Dread and its creeping darkness. It would take a godlike power for us to even dream of opening our own. Well, it's good we have a godlike being in our power. <coughs> yeah, godlike power? Yeah. Yeah. What we need is a miracle, or some of that divine intervention I've been hearing about. Uh... Of course, that's it. Power's right here in Rigbar. Not godlike, but natural god. I'll be back. Does that mean you have to babysit Lucas again? Oh, level one god. <laughs> You'd think that'd still be really strong, but no. Wait up, Lucas. Wrong side of the screen. Oh. Is something wrong? What is it? You look as though you've just seen spears rain from the heavens. So that's a specific look. That's not it. Something bigger than that. And much, <laughs> much worse has happened. Is it? <laughs> Sorry about that. Yeah. I need your the help. The end of the world. I mean, that could... Spears from the from the heavens could be the end of the world. I'm all ears. For you, I'm happy to assist however I can. I need you to open up another gate. This time to Calamity's Edge. Calamity's Edge? Why on earth do you need to go to a place like that? Well, it's a long story. Telling story off screen? Yeah, unlike Pokemon Mystery Dungeon where it just repeats the same story to you several times. Yeah. I see. An ancient dragon and the Fathomless Dread. Really? You know about these things? Yes, after the lightning struck me, many of my old memories came rushing back. That's how lightning works. It's not. It is when you're a god. So you understand just how dangerous the Fathomless Dread is? Yes. All too well. Then you'll help me, won't you? Please open a gate. No. I cannot. Why? No, why not? As a god, I am but an impartial observer. Oh, stupid true neutral bullshit. In truth, I am forbidden from inter interfering in mortal affairs, no matter how trivial. In this, and in a situation such as this, where the fate of the world hangs in the balance, well, my hands are tied. Damn it! Damn it, you're saying you'll just stand by and watch as everything is destroyed? That's my job! If that is fated to happen, yes. <coughs> Damn it, Lucas. Uh, True neutral is the worst. It's, nice it's not, but it's more of a lawful matter here. Mm. Lawful neutral. Yes. So is what I was saying. Who made that rule in the first place? God. <laughs> Very helpful. Um, and which god was that? Me. Uh, so this is a rule that you made for yourself. This is just an elaborate way of saying I don't feel like it. <laughs> um, Which means that if you break the rule, nothing bad would actually happen. Yes. Well, well I would feel <laughs> a little bad about it. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it, <Game>. Lucas. <laughs> a little? Uh, Most of the global would happen to the townspeople. How would you feel about that? Hmm. Yeah. Just imagining that, or just imagining it makes it feel as though I might burst into tears. I feel a little bad. 
That must be like losing us would hurt a lot. Why, you're right. How unexpected. <laughs> you can beat a god in a debate over dumb arbitrary stuff. That was a really easy debate. <laughs> Not all gods are smart, okay? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Thanks, Lucas. I am also forbidden from feeling compassion to for mortals. And what? yet You're really bad at following your rules, guy. Never could I have foreseen how much I come to care about or care for the people of this town. As long as I feel this way, I suppose I am compelled to help you. Lucas. You'll regret it, Lucas. Let's not waste any time. One, two, three. Uh, huh? Uh, nothing happened. To prevent anyone passing by from stumbling on the gate, I've opened it in the field behind the silo. Please take care. Please take care of yourself. Thank you so much. I will. Thank you very much. Yeah, because no one would ever walk near the silo for any reason. It's dangerous. There's also a portal behind the silo that leads you up into the clouds. Yeah, all the dangerous portals are next to the silo. Again, where people can easily and freely walk still if they wish. It's too dangerous to bring someone with me. I have to do this alone. Oh, no people are allowed to go. Are your monsters allowed to go? Yeah. split up here. Okay. Bye-bye. Fighting by your side felt so good. You spent most of the time unconscious, honestly. Well, that's because she was 70 levels lower than everything. <laughs> she might still be. Yeah, she's still 60 levels lower than everything. Hey, what's up? Okay. If you ever need help, you know who to call. It doesn't have to be a mystery. It never is. Chris. I'm gonna go punch a bully king. How many times? All the times. You can't warp while also sitting on the back of an aminal? You can not. Very large woolly. I have a stupid blister on the point of my toe, and that's annoying. Punch. One butt punch was all it took, huh? And there went the portal. <laughs> yes. Well, they don't. Sub that one back. doesn't respawn. To get him to come back, you just have to walk in and out. Yep. I chose this place for a reason. There's a second one that's up in the clouds, but I'm not fighting him. Because you have to walk farther. Butt punch. I'm not being very cooperative here, Mr. Wooly Guy. We didn't do it in the very first two times that we did this. Moving monsters. Wait, why am I doing it this way? As opposed to... Nothing. Oh, you couldn't steal. Oh, you got a crystal fragment. That's pretty good. Pretty good. That's not what I was at. But it is a cool thing to get. That's true. See that now. Nice. Thank you. Watch her crystal. And magic crystal. You could use that. Hammer time. Collaborate and listen. Get out of that so I can hit you with it again. Ah. Oh, and then he killed him. Well, I can only get one thing from him that way, so I punched it. Oh, I thought he killed it. <laughs> Yeah. 
that's not the right type of fur. But at least it's on the right track. Alright. You made me miss. <laughs> you also walked straight into the fireball kit. That guy is the worst decision you can make. <laughs> Wait, there's a water crystal over there. Right. Oh wait. Oh, apparently they do come back. I did not think they did. That's it. I'm at him. points. A fish. Because of throwing the thingy. Yep. My skill edit isn't all that good yet. What is it called? Capture skin. And permanent friends don't count towards capture skill? Nope. Hmm. They count towards my taming skin. Different skill. Hey. Oh, he's gonna go to bed and look on me? Yo! <laughs> Yo! Yo! Harvest festival, blah, blah, blah. Bye. Whatever. Bedtime. And then you can't go do it at first tomorrow because you gotta do the thing. And that'll harvest festival. And you can fish as well in the morning. I'm gonna go punch a harvest festival tomorrow. I punch the princess. <laughs> what? What is that from? Borderlands 2. Borderlands 2. Borderlands 2. When he's. When they're playing Bunkers and Badasses, which is the D&D XP, um, he, was it, he rolls a natural 20, and then when she asks what he wants to do, I he says remember. he punches the princess. I do not remember. <laughs> Why does he punch the princess? Because he punch, that's his character, he punches things. Yeah, he's, he's called the, what is it? Brick. The, the... It's like the Puncho Mancer or something like that. You're so good at sleeping. It's like when someone's a rogue, they feel that they that they oblige them to just rob everybody, including party members. Uh, Where is that a case? D and D. Just some players. Oh, I thought you meant like that was a stereotype in one of the games, and I was like, I don't remember that. <laughs> My rug didn't steal from the party member. Yeah, you're not one of those players. Thankfully. <laughs> when Cecil shows up to catch it. <laughs> oh, <no>, she's blush. <laughs> of course, excellent choice. Gifts indeed. And make gifts. Ooh, you got a, a, a dumpling. Curry manju. Thank you. Kare. All my trees are dead. It's sad and tragedy. That's what happens with trees. No, that's what happens when terrible... Tsunami happens. Also, you gotta sell two disasters. That can happen in this game? Yes. It will destroy your plants. It's just random act of God? Mm hmm. So and if you don't have the keep it from destroying your plants item, um, then you just lose all your plants. I guess that's realistic. And you can't get the kill, the heal, protect all your plants item until, like, fairly late in the game. So if you take too long, you just lose everything. I give. Nice. Right. Izzy's spirit is broken. It's not farming if everything doesn't Break suck it. sometimes. That was worse. <laughs> it was. 
You know, nothing says you have to have it on that corner of the farm. Five. This is what I'm used to it being. It doesn't look right over here. You don't look right. I look right and left. Only when you're crossing the street. Ah! Stump nerd. Oh, not stumpy. Well, it has hit points, so I don't know why it's not growing. Oh, it is growing. It just they take a lot of time. And I just felt like it had been there for like a month like that already. It hasn't. Uh, How grown is it? Because it's by 27%. So it's been a quarter, so like a week and three days. Oh, here comes the beat the shit out of stuff crowd. That's how they water. They stomp on it, and that's watering things. I think I have enough pumpkin. Great. There's another blue thing. Yeah. Fist skill went up. You can punch better now. It's actually really unusual that it gave you an increase in fist skill, isn't it? It is! Of the pumpkins that you have? Yeah. These are the pumpkins that are for sale. I thought you had more than that, though. Oh, in your inventory. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I missed these ones. Progress again. Why did we both acknowledge the music at the same time? Okay, gar. One brain cell. There, there. There, there. There, there. No, my favorite is when he says all right. An, an, an inordinate amount of times all at the same time. That's part of farming. It is summer. He likes being fluffy. He does. I'm happy for him. That's why you named him Fluffy. <laughs> Oh. It can cut a mammoth. We're talking about fits. Bolt. Link. There, Link. There, there. <laughs> there, there. Flow wolf. There, there. There, there. There, there. There, there. Yes! Yes! Uh, there. Uh, there. 
there, there. You can never tell if you pet the dragon because it is so tall. There, there. Oh, baby, there, there. I must have gotten him. There, there. Wait, there's items on the ground. Oh, right. Black feather. <laughs> I think that was it. <laughs> he was playing using a um, impact drill as the instrument. What? You went like vroom, vroom, three. Oh no! Was that you both dreeting and freaking out? Yeah, there's a cow. There, there. We have two of them. One's named Karen. What are you gonna do? There, there. Not give her a thanks. Doesn't appreciate. There, there. You never like diamonds, only shit that you can break. What? It's lyrics to a song. That's funny. Talking about having a bad relationship and how she She's didn't ever like- diamonds for it, she just- She doesn't like it. No, She's... she likes something that she can tear up and waste, is what the idea oh, is. There, there. Oh yeah, you forgot to put the grass in the bin. Spoder friend. There, there. Spoder friend. He really should have said your friendly neighborhood spider friend at some point. It works. <laughs> strawberries everywhere. These strawberries have been here too long. They yeah, went away. Phenomenal. So now that means that you right, have to fix the soil. Song. Which, there is some soil heal right there, actually. not amazing, but it is some. Smack. There are usually like three here, what the heck. We decided no. We've had some times where he'll be cleaning up the farm, and then he'll turn around and a new stump will appear in the air and fall onto the ground. <laughs> <laughs> so that's where stumps come from? Yeah. This fall from the sky? Yeah, it's probably Lucas doing it. Dang it, Lucas! It likes stumps. You need some on every farm. There, there. Oh, right. He's giving you sticks, okay? Because they're like, it's a miracle. I'm like, it's not. <laughs> Look, he's so tall. <laughs> Baby there, there. Oh, you can ride on its head, too. Petting golems is funny. You can ride on their heads. Together now. Isn't it great? Yes. That's the doors, though. You should be able to fire its fist somehow. It's a, it's a funny mech. Ooh, that seems like it'd be more destructive than that. Although, now you need to level him up and the other golems so they can take care of all your stone issues. I hope that can't beat up your plants, though, while you're doing that. You gotta not have anything out. Really, you need to plant more stuff there. Oh, one left. Hey, there's the cucumber you needed for the sandwiches. Yuck. Oh, right. You don't nope. like cucumber? What? You don't like cucumber? I cucumber really? I don't like the flavor of cucumber. That's surprising. Why? I just didn't expect you to dislike the flavor of cucumber. I just like all sorts of flavors. I just didn't expect that to be Ooh. one of them. There's an arrow pointing at that stump. Can you see it? No. Nope. Toynips. Oh. I see that. Might as well try. Sell one. Take and this. And this. Oh. Raise the roof. Oh wait, it drops seeds! Yes. Those should be level 6 seeds, right? 
I would imagine. Yep. Slash. Yes. All right. And so level nine is like ridiculously difficult. Okay. 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 Nope. Although I don't actually know that you used any fertilizer on those. Do I care you need a fire? If not, you have a bunch in the bowl. Whereas Izzy used to say Grinifer. And I was like, it's not Jennifer, but as a the color green. Green Jennifer. You don't have any of them yet. You might need some for cooking. Yes. Oh. The effects of those stack. Yes, I control, believe so. But it's depreciating value over time. That's not what you were reaching for. It is absolutely not what I was reaching for. What just happened? Oh, I... You grabbed the wrong thing. No, I, I did grab the right thing. Oh, yes. it's just already in your inventory. It's in or my in hand, your hand rather. How you growing? How you growing? Yeah. Why are you growing? Yeah. It comes out okay. Yo, I was well, equipped or whatever again. I, I, yeah, I need something equipped. What my weapon? This weapon. Yeah, that ripped apart the soil. The, the, the soil's the, health. The door? Yeah. Uh, no, the greenifier. So the more you do, the more it damages the soil. I need to get some stuff to fix the soil, which isn't hard. I can do this. I know what to do. Rain, you know what to do. What do you do? Take off every zig. That should be 90 hit points to it. Exit points on the soil. Yeah, page 255. Done. Like how that's your fix it now, please, stash. <laughs> I don't have anyone inside the bard here. Just you three in here all outside. There, you have the mermaid. There. They're still on the fire island. Oh, that's right. <laughs> 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 and then the other one is currently the um, golem. But we were walking <laughs> around with the golem because it's friend. It's a little stone mech. Does a mech being made of stone make you like it more or less? Um, I'm pretty sure that's a neutral no, value. It is. So it doesn't matter whether the ore is metallic or not? No, it just depends on the aesthetic you go for with it. Well, this is like western castle design. Right. It's a Mazinger. What? There's no, uh, qu there's not quite a pile there, but oh, yeah, head shape I mean... and... I'm riding on top of its head. Yeah, a brick castle design that's best off being stone. It's a tradition. He's a little cannibal. Look, he has like jet fists too. Speed! They're propulsion fists. I don't know why they're spinning, but 
That's a good thing for hands to do. Hey, you know who's last here? Oh, it's you this time. Usually it's Cecil. What are you doing? Rocket punching <laughs> right in front of Hina, and she didn't even care. <laughs> she said it's dangerous. She's not allowed through the door, apparently. You have a little smiley face above you? No, the uh, golem had a smile. Oh, face. Ah, bitches! <laughs> it looks like it's yours. The longer you're around them, they the like. Who likes just punch, being told to punch people? We have so much fun outside today. Can't wait for the summer festival to start. We're gonna have a great time. I've made him much bassier just because doing his higher pitched voice is very exhausting sometimes. Hey, it's perfect day to try. I'm gonna make Fuka a bead bracelet for her birthday tomorrow! We gotta catch a fish. Fibs. We like a lot of super sparkly beads that I think go beautifully together. I hope she likes it. If you can't find a golden salmon, give her an emerald. I'm so happy I get to see you today. I am. Mm, the sun feels so good today. Even the flowers are blooming with extra glow. Is watching you. Going, Normally, I'd want to win something like today's Summer Harvest Festival, but I honestly wouldn't mind if you beat me, Izzy. How do you, do? you gotta go get your turnips. I have a turnip. Oh, do you have them with Remember, you? Remember, I picked two level six turnips. <laughs> oh, you I might want to separate them. You, yeah, you just. I just duck that one into the thing. Line. You're not gonna turn in the whole stack. Such nice weather! It feels good! I'm gonna do my best to win today's festival! Festival? How pleasant the weather is today. Can't help but notice. The best ranger win. Today is the, har is the Summer Harvest Festival. May the best ranger win. Man, what a nice day. Makes me want to have an adventure. Anything back. I'm determined to win the Harvest Festival today. First place, here I come. No. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> mother, mother, me, and her children. Is he embraces? Your body and soul make you feel completely the same. Although Harvest Festivals are far from my realm of expertise, I will strive to put my best foot forward today. Good luck. You're not going to win. Oh, well, that's my job. I'm the <laughs> farmer. I'm the video game boy. Why is this this angle? I am the video game boy. I am the one who wins! Woo. Yeah, why is it at this weird angle? Can you move the controls on the camera? It's in my farm controls, like I'm on the farm again. But I'm not. That's weird. Talk to all of you. Yeah, you talked to all of the... Ladies, I ain't gonna talk to all of the guys. Hello, gentlemen. You're full of energy. Ugh, perfect weather for a nap. Okay. So, did you grow something good to show us today? Jokes. Hey, a nice weather day, huh? Oh, you stopped by the bass after today's festival. Yeah. Can't nothing like a nice hot soak after a fierce competition. It's true. He offers for you to take a bath every time after the competition, but it's closed on the day of competitions. <laughs> Hi. Whatever your plans for the day, be sure that the, I'm sure the weather is nice as this can only improve. All right, time to find more mysteries. Uh, oh, hey. Group conversation. Damn, it's hot out. Why are we all having a festival when it's the eye searing? It's like this eye searing bright. Is it a good thing we have sunny weather of, on festival days? Just swing by the bats if you want to, or if you work up a sweat. I'm gonna make them extra special tonight. See, Misa gave me some brand new bath salts. Behold, fragrance of 10 million roses. Whoa. This is wonderful. Marvelous. The name alone suggests that it has a most exquisite aroma. Let's smell the rose. Does it really have 10 million roses in it? <laughs> Bro. <laughs> I'm sure that's just a metaphor. However. However? Isn't that particular spent supposed to be extraordinarily expensive? Uh. uh I didn't mention it. Misa did say she put it on my tab. We best avoid using this. Whoa! 
Oh, also, you know what's really fun about group dialogue we learned in this game? You only get the points for social if you talk to each person and prompt the dialogue multiple times. So that was for Cecil. Cecil. I'd love to know what you think of my weapons. Weather's best sweat. Also, no, you won't be doing that because no one's allowed in the bath today. But now we know why there wasn't allowed in the bath today. He had expensive bath salts. But he didn't add them because they're too expensive. This is wonderful. You just settled for like a thousand roses. Roses. Dozen red roses. Dozen red roses. I can't see things. Where is all the old people going like this the whole time? Yeah! Oh, the nice weather we had today. It makes me want to take you for a walk. We prepared for the festivals. For everyone, not go easy on anyone today. 